Those of us who want to go higher in the Lord, we need to understand him fully. He can change his mind. When he's changing his mind concerning you, may it be for good. Amen. May he never change his mind concerning you for evil. Amen. If he's already well with you, my prayer is that even if God is going to change his mind, it will be to move you from glory to glory. If things are hard for you now, I pray that even before this day is over, God will change his mind for good for you. Amen. The conclusion is found in Ezekiel 33 from verse 13 to 19. Ezekiel 33 from verse 13 to 19. God said, if I say to the righteous, righteous man, you are going to leave. And then the righteous man now says, ah, God has already prophesied good concerning me. And he begins to double into sin. He said, he will die. He said, if I say to the wicked, however, wicked man, you are going to die. And the wicked man says, hey, I changed my mind. I changed my ways. God said, then I will change my mind too. And you will leave. Backsliders, I hope you are listening. You have been born again, you are on your way to heaven, and now you begin to live like a child of the devil, you are heading for hell. And those of you who are not yet children of God, and without any doubt you are heading for hell, but if you will change your mind today and cling to Jesus Christ, you will miss hell, you will leave and make it to heaven. The choice is yours. If you choose to be on the side of the Lord, whatever evil has been in your destiny shall be removed. Amen. 